The impressive high-tech building designed to inspire students and produce extraordinary research collaboration was officially opened recently at UBC's Okanagan campus. This 160,000 square foot engineering management and education building, referred to as EME, is the home to four disciplines, the School of Engineering, Faculty of Education, Faculty of Management, and the College of Graduate Studies. Seeing the campus evolve, all the planning coming to fruition, and now being in the building, which is really the emblem of the completion of that first phase of growth, is really very inspiring and and to be in such a beautiful building also gives me a sense of hope for the future because I really know that this is going to be a place where students are going to feel energized excited and where they can really get together you can see from the activity going on in here as this ceremony goes on that this is already a heavily used I would say fully used building this building represents the end of phase one for the Okanagan campus in terms of building a complete university here in the Okanagan. It's not, however, the end of the story for UBC because we continue to build and we continue to extend our reach from Kelowna into the whole region of the Okanagan. Housing all four disciplines in one building provides cross-disciplinary learning opportunities. The campus is very much about interdisciplinary, multidisciplinary, cross-disciplinary work. That's actually not normal in many ways in universities uh, of this standing. This is a building that symbolizes all of that, but more than symbolizing it, it actually lets you do it. It really lets you do it, asks you to do it, invites you to do it. The EME building was designed and built with the needs of students in mind and is also environmentally friendly and energy efficient. One of the building's distinguishing features is the Richard S. Hollisey's atrium, named to recognize the private support by the Hollisey family, provides bright, spacious areas for students, faculty and staff to socialize, study and interact. It's alleviated study space around campus, that's the first thing. Clearly now we have a lot of study rooms that students can now go use, additional study space, open study space here on campus. It's a bright building. It's wonderful, it's in, in, inviting and welcoming for students to actually come here and study, and we do see it populated from the, in the morning till the evening. The Jacobs Walkway, also sponsored by private donations, links the two towers together, adding easy accessibility as well as some additional unique quiet spaces. We have three generations of engineers in the family. Our late sister was a chartered accountant and uh, we both done some management training and management degrees above, so it was just it was a perfect fit. You can't be in this building without knowing you're in this valley. And that for me is really, really important because it, it actually is a a reminder of, symbolic of, stimulant to all of us working on issues that, that are relevant to this valley here. 